gonna set up our uh, kiddo bunks, which are portable bunk beds we brought uh, for the kids. And that way they didn't have to sleep on the ground or you know, share a bed with us. And I'll show you a little bit about what they are. So this is the kiddo bunk that it comes with. Comes in a nice easy carrying case. There's actually two of them. So a top and a bottom. Uh, it's made by Disco Bed, as you can see there. <clears throat> and then this is the other one that's actually open and you can kind of see a little bit the way they're actually packed. They're packed very nicely. You got the rails here. You got the actual uh, canvas uh, that they sleep on. This is a carrying case and pouch for all their stuff. So a side organizer, some straps to put them together, the side rails, and then all the stuff you need to uh, make a bunk bed out of them. So there are individual cots, but if you wanted to, you can put them up and set them up as a bunk bed. So that's uh, the initial setup of the first one. I'll show you what it looks like completed. This is the entire thing. It's actually pretty large. They say it can hold up to 12 years old, or up to 200 pounds. And you can see these two braces here are left to uh, be used for connecting them into a bunk bed, which I'll do now. So we got both of them connected, or both of them set up. To actually connect them, it's super simple. You literally just set one on top of the other. It rests in between um, kind of the rounded areas of each footing, and then we attach some straps, and it's good to go. And I'll show you that the way it looks right now. This is them individually. foot sits in there in the shoes. And that's it. And then they're stabilizing. Yes. And you can attach the straps on the end here to actually lock them in place so that they don't fall. Addie said that I can go in the bottom.